All right, so this is what we got this week. We have a bunch of our yogurts in the front. Um, some raspberries, strawberries, and blueberries at the bottom there. And we also have some of these little oranges and asparagus. And then moving into our like snacky food, we have some pretzel thins, some of these goldfish. Um, Chris, or Colton picked these out, these little Shamu <laughs> goldfish. So we got those for snack food for him. And then Chris wanted some Fruit Loops and I got some of this crisp cereal to um, help me make some homemade granola bars, which will hopefully be good because I haven't found a recipe that I really like yet. So I'm going to try out another one. And this is one of the key ingredients in it that they say make them taste better. So we'll see if that works. And then we've got some string cheeses here, um, some tortillas, some bread, a bunch of different like frozen veggies. We've got broccoli and cauliflower, cauliflower, some of the potato and green bean, um, some more cauliflower, and a little bit of rice. And then we got a strawberry cream cheese, some eggs, chicken, and ground turkey. We have some Texas toast, um, olive oil cooking spray, maple syrup, uh, a chocolate syrup to make some chocolate milk. And then we have mini chocolate chips and regular chocolate chips and some sea salt caramel truffle ice cream, which is really good. We really like the great value ice cream from Walmart. It's actually really good. And then we have a couple of packs of mandarin oranges. Colton loves to snack on these. A little spaghetti squash. I would have gotten a bigger one, but they only had tiny ones today. And then I got some bananas, some apples, almond milk, orange juice, um, vitamin D for Hudson. I'm going to start mixing a little bit in his formula to get him used to switching over to his vitamin D. And then we got a couple of cans of spaghetti sauce. I found that I really like this roasted herb and garlic one. I used to just always get the traditional, but I prefer this one. And then I got some creamer, some chocolate chip cookie creamer, and a couple of things of butter because I'm completely out of butter. So that's it for the grocery haul for the week. And then for my meals, for things that I have planned for this week, I have grilled barbecue chicken with asparagus and baked potatoes, spaghetti squash and meat sauce. Uh, one of the meals is going to be like a breakfast for dinner, probably pancakes for the main thing. And then orange chicken and rice and some homemade pizza. And then for our healthy snacks that I'm going to make, uh, is fruit salsa and cinnamon sugar chips, which those are really good. And I plan on sharing a recipe video on that because it's just so good. It's one of those things that I have to share. And then we have some healthy chocolate chip muffins and or cookies. I found a cookie recipe that's made with mainly coconut oil that doesn't have like any other oils or butter in it. And it looked really good. So I think I might give that one a try. But I also made some cho some healthy chocolate chip muffins last week, and they turned out really good. So I don't know if I'm going to make both or just one. I might make them both and then just put some in the freezer so that we have healthy snacks and desserts um, just on hand. And then I also want to make some healthy blueberry muffins and some granola bars. Like I said, I'm going to try another recipe. And if you guys have any recipes that you like for granola bars, let me know. But that is it for the haul today.